type 2 question might look like this. The question might say that let's say there are 10 machines in a manufacturing unit. The machines are working 9 hours per day and with that rate in 10 days the machines can manufacture 3000 components. If the same manufacturing unit receives an order of manufacturing 5000 components but the work needs to be delivered in 6 days and the maximum number of hours that the machines can work for in a day is 10 then what is the minimum additional number of machines needed to finish the work? The question is minimum additional number of units, number of machines to finish the work. So to answer this question, we need to understand one basic principle. Now we have three kinds of things. One is M which stands for manpower or the machine power that means the number of men or number of machines employed to finish the work. T is the amount of time in which the work needs to be finished and W is the amount of work to be finished. We see that there is a direct relationship between the manpower and work. By direct relationship I mean that greater work requires greater number of manpower or machine power and less work requires less machine power and therefore we call it that M is directly proportional to W. Similarly, we can say that manpower M will always be inversely proportional to T because less time requires greater machine or manpower to finish the work and greater amount of time requires less machine power or manpower to finish the work. When we combine the two things, we get M is proportional to W over T which gives us an expression like m is equal to constant w over t and m times t over w is equal to constant. How do we use this expression? This expression means that in the first scenario the ratio of m t and w that means m1 t1 over w1 will be same as m2 t2 over w2 that means the same ratio in the second scenario. Here let's try to apply the same concept in this question. M1 in this case is 10 because there are 10 machines initially. The time was 9 hours a day for 10 days that means in total 90 hours. And the work in the first case was 3000 components. Whereas in second case we have to calculate the value of x which is the manpower, the total manpower. The amount of time is 10 times 6 that is 60 hours and the total work is 5000. Now we simplify this. After simplifying this, we get x is equal to 25, which means the minimum number of additional machines needed to finish the work will be 25 minus 10, which was the original number of machines we already have. So we need 15 additional machines and here we get the answer.